Commander of Navy warship relieved of duty months after backward rifle scope photo flap. Associated Press the commander of a Navy destroyer that's helping protect the San Diego-based aircraft carrier USSTH. Theodore Roosevelt in the Middle East has been relieved of duty about four months after he was seen in a photo firing a rifle with a scope mounted backward. The image brought the Navy considerable ridicule on social media. The San Diego Union Tribune reported that Cameron Yast, commanding officer of the destroyer USS Joe N. McCain, was removed on Friday. Below are your comments. Being a retired Fleet Marine Force senior chief, I can assure you there are folks on warships who do know their way around a weapon and then there are those who simply do not. Some surface warfare officers come up through the ranks specializing in other areas such as engineer. Ing and have minimal X. See more. I'm sure the Navy was embarrassed and humiliated by the pick, but that seems a bit extreme. It had to be an accumulation of other issues, emo. Regards. He is pictured firing many rounds off the deck railing, with sailors in his proximity. He should have noticed he couldn't see a telescope target, but if there was no target, and only os. And he might not have noticed the reversed optics, and the horizon might have still made sense, as I. T's a long way off, and did he really have to look at all? There's nothing to. I think the brass was just embarrassed, but have any of them fired a weapon lately? Dot. After 23 years in the Navy I would estimate less than a one-tenth of one percent of the entire Navy had been TRA. Inned by the Navy in the use of a scoped rifle, mainly Spec Ops types and perhaps some QRF forces at some very sensitive commands. No regulation against being funny or ignorant about a subject unrelated to the job. If the picture wasn't the reason for his being relieved, why mention it in the article at all? Dot. Commanding a guided missile destroyer requires a broad S bleephead that surely includes anti aircraft, a NTI submarine, anti surface warfare. I can easily imagine firearms proficiency not being necessary or even helpful in the position. Still, I admittedly got a belly laugh out of the picture, and to command confidence, this military C. Amander should either have had better preparation or banned photographers from the site. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.